Good morning. We're in the lower 30s now. Temperatures 31 in Terre Haute below the freezing line. It is cold outside this morning. Just be aware of that when you're heading out the door. Temperatures are at a basically winter like level, and if you need to do anything uh, in the afternoon, temperatures are going to recover by that point, but because they're starting out in such a low position, it's going to take some time for them to get there. So just be aware that it's probably going to be cooler longer uh, today than it has been the last couple of days, and you're probably going to need the warmer clothing even in the afternoon. You can see our storm tracker showing where the most likely clear sky has taken over. We had some cloud activity very early this morning, but you can see it's been mostly to the north and it's gone now. So mostly sunny conditions are here today and you know it's going to look nice outside, but if you have to do anything uh, in the afternoon, just like the, the last couple of days here, we're going to start to see windy conditions. And yesterday in particular, we were very windy. We're going to be windy again today, and it's going to create an elevated risk for fire weather. So you got a lot of leaves on the ground, dry conditions in the air, and you know, you got the sunlight, you got strong winds. Uh, all these ingredients come together for uh, an elevated risk for fire. So just be careful. Don't burn anything outside, at least this afternoon, because it could be easy for these fires to get out of control. You can see the lunchtime through five. We don't really see an opportunity for change uh, just off and on clouds with no attachment to rain. And you know, over the course of the evening, the winds will die down somewhat. Now you can see off and on clouds now over the course of the night, scattered showers are going to be possible. Maybe some light sprinkles farther to the south uh, where you see clouds in the future cast, but the substantial rain, you can see it to the north here. This is tonight. The thing is, these clouds, these rain showers are going to move through very fast, faster than expected. So that's good news if you're looking to get outside tomorrow because it looks like these clouds are going to be mostly gone by tomorrow morning. Maybe a few clouds stay behind in an off and on capacity, but for the most part, uh, by the middle part of the day, you can see where mostly sunny conditions are back. The thing is, the rain showers tonight are going to bring with them cooler air. So that means temperatures are going to be a little bit lower tomorrow and maybe even less comfortable for you in the afternoon. If you are heading out the door uh, over the course of the day tomorrow, early is going to be cool in the afternoon. You're going to cover Bridge Festival. It's going to be even cooler as we move through the afternoon with off and on clouds returning uh, late tomorrow night. So just be aware of that. It is going to be very fall like and maybe that's what you're looking for if you are if you do have any weekend plans, you can see we're in the upper 60s uh, today. Winds gusting up to 35 miles an hour. Strong winds to start to die down tonight. A chance of rain tonight, mid 30s. Over the course of the day tomorrow, we're right around 60. And again, lower temperatures, sunny conditions. Seven day forecast shows one more day with temperatures in the mid 60s before we really start to cool down. And it's uh, a very late fall like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday with overnight lows in the 20s, Monday night into Tuesday.